Oh, got you putting the glasses on. Look, that was like an action shot, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, you know where we're going today? I do. No, no, she doesn't know. Oh. It's, a, it's a date day. It is a date day. Date day! Yay! Yeah! Welcome to Jersey Junction, home of yummy ice cream and whatnots. Candy. Oh, this candy, candy. So the mother of Jersey Junction is also the mother of Chris Van Ellsberg, who is the author of Polar Express. Here is a train signed by him. Polar Express. I'm thinking that that's Doris. And then standing in front there, and from that gaslight, there she is too. Lots of fun pictures in here. There's a fun guy. <laughs> so inside they have all these fun pictures. Look at that ceiling. The tin ceiling. This place is hard. So look at all these. It's of a bygone era. It is. Check this one out though right here. Look at that. So 1914, over a hundred years ago. Cool! Pretty cool looking place, eh? Alright, right there, people, is a vanilla malt. And you, Miss Jen. I have a toasted coconut single scoop. Look how huge that is. Cool, close up. Yummo. Right up here is one of the original gas lights. Uh, now, Chris Van Ellsberg is responsible for those. She was the first city commissioner that was a female in East Grand Rapids. So she came up with the name Gaslight Village. Here's one of the original ones on the porch to honor that whole situation. Check it out, there's even like a plaque that tells you all about it and stuff. Yeah. Gaslight Village, Jersey Junction. So there we were. Yeah. What'd you think about that awesome stuff from uh, Jersey Junction? It was amazing. My ice cream was so tasty. I haven't had oh. coconut ice cream in forever. Mad props, dude. Yeah. Like that. Oh, that malt was so good. Yum, yum, yummo. Thank you, Jersey Junction. Yeah. For some yummy ice cream. And the Polar Express stuff. That was pretty cool, too. Mm -hmm. We love the Polar Express. Right on. So here's kind of an overview of downtown East Grand Rapids. And we are underneath a parking garage structure art stuff. Check it out. So yeah, that's the entrance to the parking garage. Pretty cool looking, eh? I think it looks like a fish. Alright, here's a sculpture by Brian Alexander. What What do you think this is? I think it's a flock of birds. I don't know. I'm not sure. Flock of birds it is. This bank almost looks like it doesn't belong. We're not in New York City. Stuff be blooming, people. Check that out. Looks pretty cool, huh? Yeah. East Grand Rapids. It's one of the famous gas lights. Yeah. It's even on. Look at that. Woo! Yeah, this be a poppin' place, huh? It is. It's People like everywhere. Three o'clock hit, man. School got out. It's like, what, what? Yeah. Yeah. Had like a little crash behind us. A little bike accident. Uh-oh. They're okay, though. No, no worries. Outside of the store, they even have a water bowl for your four-legged friends. <laughs> So we've been smelling some hot dogs, man. Mm -hmm. I think we have it kind of like nailed down. There's like a grill up here. But I think they had some hot dog business going on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right up there, those people, they had some hot dogs or something. They want to mess with everybody and put that smell out there in the air. That hot doggy, yummy. Yeah, them up there. And right there marks the end, or maybe the beginning, of Gaslight Village. Complete with gas lights. Yeah. Reed's Lake right there. Yeah. Boss, right there. And then over here, let me zoom out. Yeah, there we go. Over there we have the football field, East Grand Rapids, yeah. And over there, oh, we have got the library. We took you there before, right, Jen? We did, I took you there, I took you guys there. Remember the fish tank and stuff? And more East Grand Rapids. People, that be the date day. That was it. That was we, it? We had a date day. Yep. So, yeah, East Grand Rapids is a really nice area. It's kind of like a, uh, a fairly affluent area yes. ar around here. Uh, so they have a lot of nice shops and restaurants and things like that to check out. They do. So after having some super nosh ice cream, it was nice to just walk around and kind of stroll and window, window shop and do things of that nature. Yeah. Do any of you 
sorry. Do any of you have a place that you do something like that? If so, leave a comment down below. We'd, we'd love to know where that is. Yeah. Right? Right. For sure. So, yeah, it was a great time. Thanks for coming along with us. We're going to try to take you out to some more places because, once again, it's nice out now. Yeah, so we can go outside. Yeah. <laughs> Hashtag nice weather, right? Mm hmm all right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. We seriously appreciate it. Like a bunch and stuff. Yeah, it's awesome. Uh, if you haven't subscribed and you want to, like, that would be cool. No no pressure. No, no hassle, though. You know what I'm saying? But really, though, thanks for everything. And until we see you again, keep your nose clean.